Hey, it's Sarah and welcome back to my channel. So we are continuing our Grand Theft Auto Mayhem Mischief Adventure um, and I'm gonna do my best to just stick to main story missions because I feel like you guys like those the most but if something happens on the side, I might get a little bit distracted just so you nice and know. With that said, let's get started with Grand Theft Auto. There's our auntie. Oh my goodness. I just realized she was carrying two pound dumbbells. Those don't do anything. Unless, of course, you're recovering from an injury. Then those do a lot, actually. So I take back what I just said. <laughs> ay, ay, ay. Okay. Let us... Oh. T. Nigel. Who's Nigel? Wait, since we're on our way, let's go to a rampage. <laughs> Let me check out my cars if they're still there. Oh, not there. Okay. Let's just call a cop. Mm. Over there. Right. Good. I need a cab, Toronto. On its way, sir. Thanks for calling. Much obliged. <sighs> oh. -oh. I was gonna be coming from here. Knew it. Hey, my man, where are you going? Mirror Park. I want to listen to the cab. You know what? This is like. <laughs> it's this guy again. Yes. Are we straight, son? Yes, sir. Good. Now you take care. You hear? Thank you, sir. I'm lost for words. Next caller. Hi there, Dwayne. My name is Susan. I'm calling from Sandy Shore. <laughs> Let's just fast travel. Save us some time. I wish we had more garages though, so that we can steal more cars. It's just more fun that way. <sighs> Okay, let's try to get 50 kills in this rampage. This is the spot, right? 81! Oh my god. Wait, who are we killing this time? Oh my god. But he wouldn't understand that. I told him I'd make a movie about his ass and call it Cunts in America. But that will be the post-ironic use of the word cunt, both offensive and at the same time curiously anodyne. Hey, what the fuck? I find your t-shirt more than yes. a little offensive. You There's are one a... thing I cannot stand. It's post-ironic hipsters. If you oh like my it, god! You go back to Canada, dude. Come on, you want a piece of me, huh? We're oh, wait. oh fuck! Oh, We're fuck. shooting oh, hipsters! Fuck. Oh my god! Wait, how does he have a gun all of a sudden? <laughs> oh my god! Like, it's so... <laughs> uh, I'm not even gonna question it, but he was scared and then all of a sudden he had a gun and then all of a sudden all the other hipsters came out with their own gun. Los Santos, you are something else. <laughs> oh, shucks. Poser. Okay. <laughs> 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 
feel like I need to find cover. Oh, you think you're so superior! Yo, 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 yo! They were right. Hipsters are dead. Hipsters, oh my god. Ten headshots. Ah, 30 kills, but we needed headshots as well. Okay. I like how that guy's just walking away from me. Like, mm, okay. Nothing to see here, folks. Everything's normal. Ooh, it's just got a check mark. That's. Oh, we finished all of the rampage now. Cool. Okay. Let's go to Nigel and then we'll do the trouble. Maybe there's a bike we can use? <laughs> oh my god. Okay, push. Ooh, maybe we could up his stamina. Let's look at our stats. Yep, we could up our stamina. I feel like Trevor smells so sweaty and ugh, stuff. I wonder if Trevor was a perfume, what he would smell like. <laughs> sweaty balls. <laughs> God, you live. There we go, over here. <laughs> I was trying to reverse. I was wondering why he wasn't reversing. Then I realized, oh, we're on a bike. Oops. You know what? What's... What will I find there, I wonder? Oh my god, it's homeless people. That's so sad. I, you know, they should make a Grand Theft Auto game where you're a philanthropist and you just try to help people. Pretty sure there is one. Is there? I, I'm not so sure. Let me know in the comments below. Anyway, we need to work out. I can't believe I'm getting... I'm almost as fast as this bike. Ooh, there we go. How far up are we? Oh, we're still pretty far. It's okay. We'll survive. Trevor needed this after all the drugs he's been taking. <laughs> We're here. We're here, we're here, we're here, we're here, we're here. Hey, you. Hey, no. It can't be. Oh. 
There you are, hmm? Jock. Yeah, I got you that stuff. Oh, great. Thank you. Where's your wife? Mrs. Thornhill, she's mm. not my wife. She's got a husband and two lovely kiddies at home. We met online. It's oh! No, nothing sexual. Where is she? Well, she's been trying to throw herself under celebs' wheels. <laughs> well, well, she can throw herself under my wheels anytime. Oh, oh my god. <laughs> I knew you were funny, oh. Jock. Yeah. There's a dog! I knew. There's a dog! I would like you. C can I have a hug? Okay. Yeah. Oh my goodness, this guy creeps me out a bit. I've got a pr protruding hip. It's not a semi. Nigel! John! No. You won't believe what's happened! What? Only Al Dinapoli walking. He actually walks! He walks walk among, among us. us! Well, then what are you freaks waiting for? Well, that's a long story. Of mistaken identity. And a lot of lies. Stalking is not what I would call it. Not me. I told the judge I thought it was unfair. Yes, anyone's trousers could have come undone at that point. Exactly. Jolly bad <laughs> luck. And we were such fans. If only we could talk to him. Yes, I know it was only his lawyers and agents. They ruined everything. If we could only get him somewhere private. You see, like that little lockup I know. No problemo. Look, why is the, is. why are these oh, two such weirdos? Again. Nigel, he remembers me. To the chariot. Jock, you drive. Quick, he's getting away. He's taking a left turn down the high street, Jock. Did you ever imagine we might get a private audience with Al Di Napoli? Only in my wildest dreams. All those nights spent role-playing in Mother's utility room. If only we'd known. I loved him in The Redeemer. Oh, Nigel, do your Al Di Napoli line. This is turban warfare, Mother oh my God. <laughs> It's uncanny. Oh, dear. Poor Jock must think we're batting. Oh, don't be silly. The hire car! I hear that behind his chair. Oh, I won't! Jock! Do you see that lorry? What the fuck's a lorry? Have a little faith! Anyone would think this was my first kidnapping. What on earth will we feed the man? I hadn't even thought of that. He probably eats sushi or quinoa. Is that even how you say it? What if he wants meth? Don't get flustered again, Nigel. You'll have another turn. Find out! He's going into the car park! Oh my goodness. The car park! No worries, mate! Oh, I the hope he park. likes us! How could he not? This lockup you've prepared sounds charming! Just be. Oh, my giddy aunt! Everything okay there, oh Earl goodness. Crazy Cakes? My, my prostate has taken quite a beating. <laughs> Do you have to lower the tone? Glad to see you on the proper side of the road, dear boy. This must be second nature to you, Jock. All those stunts you used to do. This level of derangement, I'm impressed. Little by little, I'm tip. Is he going through the hospital? Oh my lord! Hold on to your corsets! Whoa. Maybe I should have driven. Uh. Seems rude not to follow him through the window. Oh my goodness. For me? Oh freak. my god! I was like... Would you like me to escort your guest of honor to the trunk? Well, if you don't mind. This oh, is a kidnapping here, through and through. Come on. Come on, let me meet your biggest fan. Ah. You're fucking crazy. Oh, it's Get off me. Me. Uh. 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 Oh, God, there. <laughs> You're good to go. Ah, a true gentleman. This is so exciting. Not crazy. Nuts. Bunch of nuts. Stalker and not a scratch. It's stalker. Oh, it's broken. Car is broken. Of course it's broken. 
Oh, look at the hospital. We made a wreck. Ay, ay, ay. Let's just go here. Go. Let's wait for a cab. What's a potato? Potato? Wait, there's a lot of cabs. Which one's my cab? Oh, this one's my cab. So where do you want to go? La Puerta! What? Alright, let's hit the road. Oh, it's Ice Cube. He was stopping though. I wish I could have heard him. So that I could practice my Espanol. Practicado Espanol. Okay, there you go. Ooh, what's here? Ooh. Oh my gosh, are we buying this? Oh my goodness, we're buying this place, aren't we? Oh. Oh, no, no, no. Ah, uh, it's okay. It's Trevor's old place. Got it. I miss you already. What the f word are you doing here? It's what a the funny f way to greet your cousin. You ain't my G damn cousin, Trevor. G I damn. We was family. But please, just go and ruin somebody else's home furnishings. Who the f is that? Boy? No one, my sweet. Hey, by any chance, did you catch crabs at that conference? I heard that those conferences are regular little fuck fest, huh? Guy, come in. Huh? I'd like you to leave mm. right now. Oh yeah. Oh, how is this Some place cleaned up already? Serious corporate gang banging going on, right? Yeah, with every executive and director of communications from here to Bangalore taking it left, right, and center in the name of team training, right? I mean, now that's what Floyd told me yesterday as he was staring at my uh, my penis. I want you to leave. Look, this is all I've got. <laughs> oh all right, I had a tough upbringing. My daddy was not nice to me. Okay? And look, Deborah, I love you and I love you too, Floyd. Why can't we all just be together? Huh? You can have Mondays through Thursdays. You can have the weekends, all right? I know that's not normal, but in this crazy, crazy world. That's all days, it's though. so good. Huh? Look, Deborah, Floyd, will you marry me? Get out of my car! <laughs> what the what hell? Do I, do, Floyd? I told you, I've got a career. I don't need this, this, this crap. Yes. <gasps> there. <laughs> Bad you word. made me swear. Oh my you God! Crap, Floyd. Crap. <laughs> You're not a man at all. Oh. Thoughts about you. Oh. Who's Whoa, Bob? who's Bob? I want both of you to go now. You and your weird friend. Whoa, hey. Who's Bob? My name is Trevor, sweetheart. I could give a fuck what your fucking name is. I'm not a <laughs> I'm not. Bob taught me. Fuck Bob. You who's Bob? Are not very fucking nice. What in the world? What did we just do? <gasps> oh, hey there, Trevor. Yo, for real? <laughs> oh. mm, hey there, Wade. Did you meet Gebra? Interesting lady. Yeah. I should probably go say hi. I wouldn't. Why not? Let's go get in the car. Why is this right. basic? That? Let's go have the time of our lives. Yo, did we kill Deborah and Floyd? <sighs> I know just the place. Yo. Yo. I could run in and get Floyd and Deborah. I know she seems kind of uptight, but she can have fun. Mmm, no. I don't think she can, Wade. Just Floyd, then? 
Floyd's gonna meet us there. Blake's trip. Exactly. Oh, Trevor, what have you got all over yourself? You're all red. You got, you got <laughs> syrup? Yeah. <laughs> Is that syrup? Syrup. Accidents. We've all been there. We sure have, but, but it don't taste like syrup. Don't taste me, all right? Just Ew. No licking. Okay. Hey, you remember when we met? Sure. Last year. I was on the way to the gathering with Daisy Bell and Kush Chronic and... And you stopped in Sandy Shores to get lit and you met a dealer and he looked after you when your friends had abandoned you. That was weird, weren't it? The last time I saw him, it was with you driving out to the quarry and then they just disappeared. Poof, <coughs> right? I mean, they were gone. Some friends, right? And now Cousin Deborah don't want you around? I mean, there's a pattern here. The Congo did get messy. The pattern is you can't rely on anyone, anyone except me. Um, I don't think so. I don't think so, mister. Okay, let's... Look, this is it. Safe cars with parking in the base at no, the side of the strip club. Oh, oh okay. Strip club? Oh, yeah. Okay. Uh, we can save like cars him. here now. Homebody. He loves that apartment. Interestingly, you and me, we got a new home. Where? <laughs> Yo, yeah. are there any dead? Right here. Yo, I. I was her, I'd be freaking out with how much Amigo. red he has all over him. Prepare to meet your new partner. Huh? What the heck, Trevor? Oh, we're back home. Hey, Lester. Oh, yeah. Hey, uh, Trevor just called about the, um, the big one, the, the UD. You know anything? Yeah. I told him we could hit it. You down? Of course I'm down. Look, I'll get my research together and meet you at Trevor's. He's taken over the Vanilla Unicorn Gentlemen's Club. All right, message Franklin. Oh. Oh, mission pass, hand pen. Oh, nice. Bro, why am I always in like <laughs> in a tanto? <laughs> Let me wear some clothes. Oh, Trevor basically kidnapped us and we were forced to live off of the trailer park. Yeah. Let's clean up a bit, shall we? Ooh, I like this one, but no. I like the blue one, Topaz. Wait a minute, was there something written? F you very much. <laughs> Okie dokie. Alright, oh what's this? Oh, let's check this out if we can. It's orange though, so it makes me feel like it's for Trevor, but I mean, let's just try it out. My bad! Return us, Trevor, to start the strangers. Oh, okay. I guess we could just. Well, you know what? We should go as Franklin. We should do some missions as Franklin. But yeah, those can wait. Let's just go. 
here. Trevor. This was a nice car. Relevant, so controversial. Safe solution surgery. Sige, go lang, bahala kayo sa buhay nyo. Okay, maybe I have to go inside. I thought it was making us go backstage for some reason. Can I have some money? It's for Can I have some money? It's for crap! My boy Mike! Good to see you! Somebody fucked with my garden again last night. Word. What would really turn me on is you wearing clown face. Yo. Okie dokie. Well, it seems like we're here. Hey. Before you ask, the fridge is broken. That's all right. I've had enough of your hospitality already. I have changed my ways, all right? Huh? Yeah, I'm done with that crazy shit, all right? I want to square things away with Meriwether, make sure the agency ain't coming back after us, and then do one last big score, and then you get to go back with your family. Me, I'm just going to live here. I'm going to run this, this good business showing people a good time. B bust Brad out of prison, and then, you know, <laughs> happy. <laughs> so how'd you come by this place anyway? I've had it for ages. So you huh? must know Leon. The old manager. Leon? I didn't know. Yeah, whatever, man. So what's going on here? What's going on is the big one. A long, long time ago in a faraway place, there were three guys. Michael, Trevor, and Lester. And Brad. <laughs> uh, yeah. Sure, Brad was there sometimes as well. I mean, there were other guys, though, too. So, uh... Anyway, we uh, robbed and lied and we hurt people. Pretty much lived a low-life kind of existence. But always dreaming of one thing and one thing only. Money. The big one. The big one. The, the big, big one. one. What is the big one? <laughs> what? The union depository. Around 200 million in gold bricks, all taken from kindly Uncle Sam, who will spend the rest of our lives being hunted by government officials if we live through the attempt. But, but it'll be my, uh, our masterpiece. So, gentlemen, let's do our civic duty and get out there and find some gainful employment. This way. Let's go. Big one. Oh. What the heck? Come in, you there? All right. We're on a strict schedule. 
there's a couple of armored cars on a dry run to the depository, the intel suggests they'll be going down Innocence Boulevard in East LS at approximately 1530. Trevor and I need to map their route for a possible hijack point, so we're going to his airfield in Blaine County and coming back in his chopper to intercept. Michael, Franklin, all you've got to do is take the temperature at the bank to see if there's anything that stands out. You'll get 20% of 200 million. A maximum of 200 million if I can get the funds diverted and you pull it off. Still, come on, 20% of that's a lot of coin for sitting on your fat ass. Is it too much to ask for a little respect? Just a little? Because I respect you, Trevor. Strangely, I do. I can see how you're useful. T, L, we're coming up to the front of the bank. Oh, wait, um. I wanna see what Franklin and Michael are talking about. Well, I can think of a few uses for you, you chubby little ball of fun. I want, want your help. All 20% of 200 million of it. Actually, man. Hey, we are uh, taking the temperature. That doesn't look like Press much. Press me to look at hey, the security bank. looks light. We send in a couple of sprung niggas. Clap, clap. What are you talking about, Frank? Oh, I see it. Man, getting in the door is easy. It's a standard bank. It's getting underground as hard. Ain't that where the metal's kept? Right. Now we gotta stop outside the Arcadia Center down on Alta Street. We can get a view of the back from there. Oh. Oh man. Alright, what's here? What is it? Yeah! I don't know why I didn't think of it before. I want to bring you in on the ground floor this time. That's not a joke about disabled access. I didn't think it was, but now I do. I ain't even talked to Mike about it yet, but he's gonna be on board. He's obligated. He's gonna be on what board. He's obligated. It? Ain't it obvious? Busting Brad out of the clink. Okay, I'm gonna stop you there, T. Some things are just better left alone. Brad's not a thing. He's part of the crew. Well, a crew's more than a sum of its parts, and he was a pretty shit part. He is a pretty shit part, and that's only because he's in jail. No, he was, is shit because he's lazy, forget- We're down on oh, the shucks. street, coming up on the back of the bank. He's changed, all right? He writes now, emails, he's educated himself inside, and he'll be a valuable part of the team. Why do you talk to Michael about it? I will, but I gotta Brad's talk to you. Brad's dead already, too. right? That, that's You're why. You're planning this. Talk I know to this Michael is stressful. And come back to me. That's oh, why I know this fine. is a problem. Shit! I was gonna pay you, man. When there ain't an obvious profit in something, you're a hard guy to motivate. <laughs> Just went 13:30. We got two hours before we need to be in Murrieta Heights. Um. Oh, Trevor, if you only knew. Get in the helicopter. Do they call it a wasting disease because you waste people's time? Move it! <laughs> That's so mean! Maybe I can... Oh! Okay. Look, dog. Light again, man. Yeah, fucking eerie, ain't it? Man, you think they put more than one motherfucker on our national fucking Oh my reserve? god, Franklin! Yeah. Relax! Maybe we really are broke. Fly to Marietta Heights. Mike's observations fit with your scheme. So far, yeah. The, the security's internal rather than external. Be careful not to get too close to the prison. We'll trip an alarm. Good point. Don't want him jumpy for the breakout. Ah, yeah. You are flying in restricted airspace. Turn around immediately. Oh. Quiet enough that any disturbance is going to get picked up immediately. What those two don't know is there's a special team of cops on standby 24-7 waiting on a signal from the UD. Won't go out on any other call. And it's never been hit. Dude, I'm ah. actually flying pretty those fast. I think I've mastered more. it already. They may be cops, but they work Ish. for the government. Oh, no, and I haven't mastered it all. Government workers love more than to accept tax dollars for doing nothing. Oh, yeah, that and spying on innocent people. 
Mm, getting paid to do nothing and spying on innocent people. Now, who does that remind me of? Anyway, if you want to hit the vault in a way that people will notice, the key will be to divert the security team. Divert it? You said they hold out for calls from the UD and that's it. They do, so we'd have to hit it twice, once to distract them and once to get it done. You're gonna find someone willing to get caught hitting a super bank just as a distraction. I was thinking, Michael, it might appeal to his ego. Oh, what am I saying? We got the perfect guy for it. Come in, Michael. There we go. Nice. We have a visual on the convoy. Keep with them, T. Ooh. Do whatever Les needs you to do. We need to stay with them and find a place to ambush. What kind of ambush spot are we looking for? I tend to wait in the jaw and catch them with their drawers down, but I guess that won't work here. No, it, uh, won't. We're looking for somewhere with cover for us and no escape routes for them. Ah, the same principle as a men's room. Yeah, mm. uh, I guess. <laughs> oh, it's going left. They're going left. Difficult than it looks. What you thinking? I'm thinking I don't like being in close proximity to you for extended periods of time, and the same for short periods of time. <laughs> oh, there's ways to make minutes go by. Oh, no, they went underneath. I've lost sight of them. Think they might be in the tunnel. Don't worry, it's a straight road. They'll come out the other side. Now, go around. Meet them at the other end. I was hoping they'd come through here. This tunnel would work for a switch. They go in, you come out. Oh, there. Let's wait for them to come out, and there they are. Nice. There they are! Back out in the open! It'll need to be a quick turnaround, but you can take them in there. Perfect. I'm picking up the cars, right on time. Hey, it, uh, it looks like we're gonna need some IDs to get in the building this way. I'm assuming that's doable, Les. IDs I can handle. Nice. Woo! That was probably my best flying yet. Hey, I was expecting you 30 seconds ago. Tell that to the traffic. <laughs> All right. Hmm. Onion 86 in the building. Onion 86. Onion 86. Now, if I remember from planning the tool store job, they're excavating the new LS Metro Tunnel around here. They take us around the building and find the construction site. Roger that! Looking for a big asshole! Oh, shots.
Okay, I'll get closer for ya. This is it? Just hold the chopper here. You can do that, right? Nice. That's good, hold some weight. Steady now. Hold it. Okay, nearly done. All right, I think I've got enough information to work nice. with. Nice. <laughs> Take Franklin to his house. Got it. Not a problem. Hey, so how you feeling about this? Feeling pretty good. We got Lester planning it. He'll get us options. There's you, a guy I know I can depend on. And then there's Trevor. Oh, no, ah, and yeah, then there's Trevor. Again. Trevor. <laughs> hey, Willie? I hope so, man. I hope he holds it together. Hey, you ain't done too good of a job at that yourself, you feel me? Yeah, well, I ain't pissed off hillbillies, bikers, a Mexican gang, some Chinese gangsters, and a private army. Oh, eh? we pissed off some Chinese well, gangsters? Oh, yeah, yeah, we did, we did. You just pissed off the FIB and the IAA and your family, man. You know what? I met Amanda, and I know who scares me the most. <laughs> Point <laughs> taken. So you gonna tell me about this Brad dude and the deal with the FIV? What happened in North Yankton back in the day anyway? This ain't the time. Man, we're about to go in together on the biggest job ever being pulled. There ain't ever gonna be a better time to fill me in on this shit. It's complicated, all right? Fuck it, I'ma ask Trevor. Don't ask Trevor. <laughs> shit, man, you sound I'ma ask shady, Trevor. Dog. Real shady. We'll talk, all right? Just later. Dude, I love Franklin. He's my favorite. Well, I, I really love them all. I love them all equally. <laughs> Not I. My mom. I'm their mom. I love them all equally. Hey, when he's got something, Lester will be in touch. Nice. Surveying the school. Oh! <laughs> I did nothing. I didn't get any of them. Well, I guess I should play as Franklin. And let's do some of the mini main missions. Mini main missions. Man, snacking and I ain't even high. Oops, this one. Oh. Chains of intimacy. Hey, Mike, you stalking me or what? Oh, wow. So, uh, you want to get a drink or something? Hang out with Michael or decline. Okay, fine, let's hang out. Yeah, for sure. Cool. So, you want to figure out a car? There are many activities to visit with friends, such as movie, tennis, or... Oh. So it's good hanging out with you, man. Is it? Well, I hope so. Yeah, me too. You know, I haven't hung out socially with anyone too much recently. I got too much family. Too much craziness. For years, you know. All in my head. What do you mean? I don't know. I guess, I mean, I guess I mean, growing older sucks. Well, Whoa. I guess it beats the alternative. Yeah, ain't that the truth? It's just, I don't know, man. I, I've made such a mess of things constantly, my whole life. Chase things, get them, hate them, chase them, get them. Bruh. Let's drink because I feel like he, we're gonna ha we're about to have a heart to heart or something. Hate him. So you got everything and you're unhappy. I don't get it. Well, I guess you gotta have something to complain about. Otherwise, life would be boring. Man, this is... You really do need help. I told you. Whoa. Dude, I didn't know 
that we can hang out together but this is this is a, a welcome surprise that's for sure but i want to see what happens and what else i'll talk about don't get to see it <laughs> they're so they're so wasted drop oh, off michael man. i am drunk as fuck i hear you man shit i'm fucking drunk <laughs> god my stomach hurts my kidneys hurt hurts my eyes hurt i can't feel my arm i don't like myself here Alright, this shit ain't fun at all. Shut up, man. Stop moaning. Shit, you're giving me a headache. Don't drink I and drive, stop folks. Drink. Maybe I should go to meetings. Yeah, you should go someplace. Any place but here. <laughs> ah, screw you. Don't pit. I will not be pitied. Watch a movie. Oh, this is the Chinese oh theater. How are you? You would kill makeup artist to the stars. I could out half a vine with. I'm not kidding. Capo Lavaro, watch a movie. Okay, let's watch a movie together. Let's see what happens. <laughs> hey, thanks for coming by, man. It's the Chinese theater. Absolutely. Good to hang out. He didn't even bring me home? Wow, what a friend. Okay. Let's do it here. <sighs> hey, I need a cab. Stay where you are. I got a driver right around the corner. Sounds good. Oh, I see him. I think. I think that's a cab. Oh. I know. You work really hard and you travel a lot. You're married with kids. Oh, or not. So, um, where is the cab? <laughs> nice.
conservative. Okay, you know let's go. Nothing. Okay, a little something that's gonna help me get some tail from those Midwestern ladies that I get to meet online. <laughs> let's pretend for a second that you're not so much of a pussy and vamos, as my cleaning lady would say. Uh, just to be clear, uh, I'm not racist. I, I meant that ironically. I, uh, I have a black friend, and uh, I didn't even really notice that you were black, uh, or whatever your people call hey, it. Get the fuck out of here. All right, let's go. <laughs> oh let's roll. Let's this roll away. Catch you on the flip side, buddy. Yo, did you see that? Half the airport's on the Dominator's payroll today. Better bond fast with that beauty, because you two are going tan. I didn't bring my idiot translator. What the fuck are you talking about? <laughs> You're driving that hunk of metal and gasoline out of a cargo plane. I'm doing fucking what? Yo, don't go on blue chip on me, bro. Let's do this. Go, go, get in here. Man, I must be crazier than you are. Oh my god. Yeah, we got lift off. As soon as we hit a suitably stupid altitude, we'll kamikaze this shit into next week. Am I right? Come on, high five. Hell no, man. Shit, I don't want you to be the last person I touch. <laughs> okay, air five, then. I don't want you to be check. the last person ATV. I touch. Check. Big pair of balls. Uh, uh, check. Okay, this is happening. Come on, let's fucking do this. Let's go! Oh, yeah! Come on! Oh, let's do some barrel rolls, man! Oh, shit! This is not the biggest hard on ever! Woo! Ride that Bronco, baby! Man to rain power roll! Hey, man, Oops. I had to ditch the fucking bike! That shit was way too intense! Ha ha! Pants full at the back! Oh, of the my flag. gosh. Oh, there's the landing zone. I see it. That's female, dude. Boobies. Yeah, I can see you being a real hit with the ladies, homie. Dude, you have no idea. I ain't see me online like flies on a turd, bro. <laughs> Man, you said it, not me. Man, if I knew it was just here, I thought it was we were gonna land on another hill. I would have taken this out earlier. Let's try to do a bullseye. Bullseye. Ooh, ooh, ooh. No. Get to Dom. Where is Dom? Did he die? Oh my god, he died. You feel that? Oh, <laughs> Lightning bolt. Zap! You're alive! You know how it feels. <laughs> Man, I know how it feels to ride an ATV out of a damn airplane. Man, how much that shit cost you per second? <laughs> it's relative, bro. How long did it take me to earn the bills? Listen, you go out walking amongst the drones. I'll be on top of the maze bank building with the higher beings. Dominator out. Bro, this guy is crazy. <laughs> Where is he going? Is he gonna jump? Oh my gosh. That is one crazy mofo. 